I'm a survivor living in New York City. I will be at the South Street Seaport every day at midday when the sun is highest in the sky. You're a fucking human being. Hey, you can make all the excuses you want, but you're the one who decided how to live your life. Do what you want to do with your life, right? Don't don't go be doing something you don't enjoy. Do what you want to do. Do what is it that you really want to do? Would you rather be dead? No. Would you rather die here on your knees? The question was what did you want to be? You have to be the hero of your own story, and you can do that. You can be the hero of your own story that woke up today. You can be the hero of your own story that got out of bed and said, I'm not doing this anymore. I'm doing this differently. 100 I am going to figure this out. And I'm going to do it only by my instincts and only by my morals and my ideals and my mind. And I'm going to be dead honest with myself because I'm realizing this is not going to last forever. And I'm going to be the nicest fucking human being to everyone I meet, possibly. And I'm going to get myself in shape and I'm going to eat healthy. And I'm going to do this because this is, this is me now. I decide that this is me. The most important thing is this. To be able at any moment to sacrifice what you are for what you will become. You gotta have a why. You gotta have a reason for why you do what you do. Pain is temporary. It may last for a minute or an hour or a day or even a year, but eventually it will subside and something else will take its place. If I quit, however, it will last forever. You're a fucking human being. And if you attach, you attach yourself, your mind, to any ideology, you're going to be on a road. And that road may or may not lead you in a good direction. You need to pay attention. You need to have time to, to think about your own, uh, your own interactions with other people, to think about like, the way you behave, to think about the way you think, to think about like, the, the direction that you're moving in the, in the world. It takes a long time. It, it takes a lot of energy. Fucking do something, man. You gotta make something happen. You gotta make your own fucking way. You gotta make your own way. And there's a lot of people that are just weak. They're weak as shit, man. And they, they have no philosophy to live their life by. They have no discipline that they've developed over years of trying to accomplish things to the point where they have this sense of, of personal sovereignty. They can take care of themselves. And like, occasionally everybody needs help. But if, if somebody will help you if they know that you're the type of person that will help them, and if you know that you're the type of person that does their best. People that, that hurt people's feelings, even if you justify it, you know you did something. And I think that thing, that fucks with your head, and it, it devalues you in your own eyes. You're not a hero in your own eyes. You're not, you're not someone who you respect. You realize that if you were judging yourself, you would judge yourself unfavorably. The more love you spread out, the more positive energy you spread out, the more you get back. The more uh, it comes back to affect you, and it goes out in ripples because the people that you affect, they affect other people as well. If tomorrow wasn't promised, what would you give for today? Forget that there was any sunlight left. What would you spend today thinking about? Yourself or the man that you know you'll get everything in your heart for? We get one opportunity in life, one chance in life. To do whatever you're gonna do, to lay your foundation, to make whatever mark you're gonna make, whatever legacy you're gonna leave, leave your legacy, and it's found through.